What's going on, everybody? Welcome to Trading Crypto. Today, we're going over Fork on ETH, which is up 23.47% today with a $26.5 million market cap, $1.1 million in liquidity. We're going to look in their, their socials, their Twitter, their website, just kind of do a brief deep dive to see what's going on here because this coin is absolutely running right now and it's only one month and five days old. So with that, let's get it. All right, everyone, let's get into Floki Fork. So Floki Fork, what is it? So we will tell you the tale of Floki and how he and his pink Viking community conquered all challenges before them. The pink Viking dog Floki has faced perilous storms of tax tokens, FUD rugs, porks, and attacked from those who want to discredit him, but he stands. You can read through that. Uh, Valhalla News have their newsletters here, their milestone, Poniex listing, uh, two-bit listing, CMC listing successful, CoinGecko listing successful. Fork memes, a bunch of different memes. If you support the fork, you can download these and share them on social media. There's 241 memes, uh, different raid a raid bot. They have a raid bot here, beta version. You can join their Telegram on here. It has how to buy their tokenomics. 0% tax, burnt liquidity. All initial liquidity provided has been burnt, ensuring no rug pulls, fair launch, equity distribution without any pre-sale marketing. It fair to all participants. No team tokens. The team owns no tokens. Here's the contract. One thing I like to look at too is how active are they on Twitter? That's one of the big things I look at for investing in any coins. If they're active on social media they, and if they call themselves a community coin, they should be active on Twitter. And it looks like they are. If you look here, fork, fork, join in the daily, join in and listen to the daily community space. So they have a community space. Together we are strong five hours ago, nine hours ago, 13 hours ago. 15 hours ago so they are very very active on their socials which is awesome that means they're very active with their community so with that let's look at the charts right now charts right now we did make a new all-time high here recently it looks like uh mac d isn't done running yet it looks like we had a little bit of a fake out here a bullish fake out we started having a, re um, a reverse here the last two hours but from what i can tell here the indicators are still looking strong especially if you go to the four hour the four hour is not looking too bad we're a little high in the rsi and the mac d but overall, the coin, the coin strength looks pretty strong here. If anything, we'd just see a slight pullback. And if we did see that slight pullback, it probably just brings back down to around 2465, which in turn would allow our indi indicators to reset and then allow us to, for that next push higher to the 1272. Because as you can see right here, we ran up to the 0.5, back to the 382, back into the 0 0.5, 618, and it's just been respecting these FIB levels ever since. So if we get a little toppy right here, I would be expecting a pullback most likely to the 786 area and then a run up to the 1272 area. Now the MACD, like I said, the MACD is losing his bullish momentum here a little bit. Every single day or four hours, you can see a lighter engulfing candle compared to a darker engulfing candle. And then if you look at the top here, the RSI is also pretty high, starting to tail back down. So not to be bearish, a slight retracement is healthy for this coin. It allows the indicators to reset, allows new investors to get in. And then after that, you can push to another all-time high. So the coin doesn't look bad at all. It has good liquidity, good market cap. But in the short term, I would be expecting some sort of pullback. Uh, the pullback would most likely be about a 15, 14 to 15% pullback, which isn't terrible for a meme coin. 14 to 15%. And then you can run up from there to the 1272, which from where we're currently at is approximately a... 54 percent run so yeah doesn't look bad guys it looks like the bullish momentum is continuing you're putting in higher highs and higher lows and i see no reason for it after the slight retracement to put in another high so with that none of this is financial advice and if you have any coins that you'd like me to chart you can just send me a super chat in the comments and i'll get to your coin within 24 hours thank you